Mia. Mia, what are we going to eat for dinner today? How pizza. Pizza. You got your socks and your shoes? Oh, okay, coffee time. Hey, seriously though, Ryan's cups are crazy. <laughs> Is that your puppies? Dad, love them, don't me. Oh, and what about Sky? No, I'm not one. Okay. What a red one! This was actually one of the Christmas presents I got Ryan, and super nice. Look at that. And clearly he loves mugs, so he's been using this one, but it's a lot shorter from our builder. But I got this one, and it's so nice. You can use it for hot and cold. It's a nice, like, garage mug. Do you have sister's yogurt? No. Mommy, it's in my bag. In my bag. Good morning, having coffee. It is New Year's Eve, half awake. We are going to my friend Tina's house today this afternoon. We need to go get a fruit tray, a little play date, and I'm gonna continue cleaning the house, but look how nice the island is. I don't have much left out right now. We just have our tree left up. I still have to do the basement one. Uh, I'm just gonna leave it up until after New Year's, but the island is very, very, very clean. And I just have a few candles left on here right now, my diptyque. I burned it on Christmas day. And then this one we got from the Fairmont for our anniversary and some other ones. This holder is from Crate and Barrel. The candle inside I think is just from like Indigo. Um, yeah. Mommy bought some waffles. Well, you have two. <laughs> And clearly I have not done my office yet. I have stuff everywhere still. I have, I took out a few of my Christmas things, but um, I'm gonna have to get another storage bin um, and do that probably sometime later today. Uh, we do have to get ready soon. So I wanted to do the whole house, but I don't think I'm going to be able to. I think the office and then the basement is going to be my next area that I'm doing because I really just got done the living room, dining room, and the kitchen, which is still a majority of the house. Look how cute these are, by the way. I got the girls like these activity books and um, I got two actually for my friend as well, um, but you can have their names inside books, which is really neat. I forget where I put the other one I got them. I got them like a cake one uh, and I still have a ton of stuff I have to bring upstairs, like these ballots and yeah. Lots of organizing to do still. So I can't decide between if I'm gonna bring my white diaper bag or my pink one today. I think I might bring my pink one. Um, I've been using the pink one a lot lately. And just so you guys know, today's the last day you can use a code uh, for my store. So it's pink25 and you get 25% off the bag. So this is gonna be the last chance. Definitely take advantage. And the white is also so pretty in Lux. I love it so much. But um, yeah, for today, my friend's house, uh, let me know what you guys are doing for New Year's. We're not doing much. We're going early so we can get back at a decent time and then honestly just like lay in bed, have wine, and relax. <laughs> the other thing I really want to do, I want to get some new fashion books. I saw some on Amazon uh, of Chanel ones and there was like a Vogue one that I might get because uh, I really love using these. I think they make for great decor, but I need some for upstairs and for like the bonus area. This guy always sleeping in all my videos. Good morning. Good morning, Max. Really funny, we went out for dinner yesterday and then I meant to, after I got ready, I meant to do like a little vlogging, but of course I didn't. So I feel like in my last recent vlogs, I've just been like a mess and you guys haven't seen me like fully finished, but uh, yeah, this is what happens though. When I'm trying to 
look nice and then this happens and I end up cleaning. So <laughs> uh, yeah, lots of uh, cleaning today in this room. The girls' closet is pretty clean like I do hang up all their clothes still right here. You guys can see all their dresses and stuff. Um, it's just the drawer situation where it can get a little messy in their hamper. On another note, I thought I would also share with you guys that, uh, well, you've seen their cribs, obviously. They're the three-in-one from Pottery Barn. Uh, but I'm going to get them big girl beds. I already bought them, and it's nice because these beds, they are expensive, but you can use these as headboards after. Uh, so I just had to buy the... Um, the mattress, the new mattress, which was a double size. And then also I had to get like the bottom um, part as well. And then uh, what was the other thing? Like a bed skirt and they have sheets already. So I'm really excited to get those in. They should be here in a few weeks. And I'll show you guys those once they come in. But I'm just really excited because they definitely are ready um, for big girl beds. And I'm really happy about that. You guys were wondering about this rug too. I actually got it at home since it was a steal. And it's so hard to find like really big rugs like this and sometimes home sense is the best place to shop or like home goods if you're in the states so i was really happy i found it it's such a nice color and i feel like it goes with the walls really nicely too very clean and organized closet which you guys saw in my last video thank you so much for the love in that video um i was going through and responding to all the comments and it was just so nice to clean it with you guys uh, I just wanted to show you a few things that actually came in the mail. So I got a Nordstrom uh, gift card from my mom and Ryan's mom. So I ended up buying this really cute um, Kirk Gregor bag and I got it on sale. But I've been wanting to try these bags for a while. And I saw them, I forget who it was, in someone's video and said that the price point and quality is really nice. So I just got this little like crossbody bag. This is the inside. It's nice and small. Like if I want to get groceries or something like that. And I like the like the nude. It's a really nice like gray soft nude. Uh, the other thing I got, this was for my mom, this Gucci Flora perfume. The bottle's really nice actually. Let me show you. It's more of a spring scent. I think this would be perfect for spring since it's very floral. Um, unless you like to wear floral year round. This is the bottle right here. Gucci Floral or Flora. Um, really pretty though. I like the gold at the top. It's really stunning bottle probably have it out for like display even it's kind of it kind of stands out a lot though but I love my Joe Malone fragrance this is probably gonna be one of my new favorite ones and the other thing I got were these shoes right here so these are the Jeffrey Campbell shoes so I love this brand so much I think they have some of the nicest shoes and these are so perfect for summertime I've been really looking for ones like this uh yeah I also got these really gorgeous emerald earrings from my friend Jenna. She got me for Secret Santa with my mom friends. So those are so stunning. I love those. I can't wait to wear them. I might wear them today, actually. Um, and then also, I just wanted to kind of go over some of my favorite year-end things because I feel like I should have done this video, but then I obviously got so busy, but I'll include it in today's video. Um, the Love Scott box, my favorite jewelry case of all time. I know a lot of you guys were asking questions. Um, and and it's on the LV website. You can buy it year round. Sometimes they don't have it in the store, but you can find it on their website. And I got my mom this actually for Christmas, but it like, it's so gorgeous. I love that you can see the inside as well. And they do have the larger one. Now, if I had to choose one, I like the smaller one. I just feel like it just, it's nicer. And like, you're really only putting your precious jewels in there anyways. Um, and yeah, I would say that one, but I really, really love it. I also love everything from Glam Luck Shop. Nicole's shop, she's just, she's got the cutest things. So her trays, obviously, like my Chanel, the Louis Vuitton one over there, and then also just like all her little trinkets and cute earrings and stuff. I love. Goal of mine is to get organized, use a day planner for 2022 because I have not been doing that. I use notes on my phone or like Google, uh, which is great. I mean, because everything's on your phone, but it is nice to write things down, even journal uh, manifesting and I think that is just like something I want to do I think it's gonna be really relaxing and it's just gonna be nice to be organized and I'm sure everyone loves to have a good day planner so I was really excited to get this one and um, let me know if you know like any inserts that I can find besides the Louis Vuitton one it's kind of a little boring on the inside but I mean yeah I'm sure there's like Etsy ones and stuff the other thing that I love so much is the Chloe fragrance that Ryan got me for my birthday. Like, yeah, he kind of did buy it, like, for the, the look of the bottle. Like, he was like, can I get a pink bottle? She's going to love pink. Uh, but he did, like, smell it and thought it would be something I'd wear. But I really love it. It's so nice. And I just, yeah, it's been my favorite fragrance right now. 
um, and it's just such a nice year-round fragrance too and it's kind of hard to explain the notes in this but it's just like a sexy scent it kind of reminds me of like that Victoria's Secret one what was it called like bombshell or something I used to wear back in the day um, but like a more sophisticated scent if that makes sense um, kind of like Miss Dior but like not as strong I feel like this is sometimes really strong to wear but I like the Chloe and I did get a facial the other day at my favorite um, it's called Vibe Rejuvenation. Battery just died, but the medical spa I go to has uh, both of these skincare brands. So I just wanted to quickly show you the new stuff I got. Um, so right here we got the Skin Medica Eye Repair. My friend Ashley swears by this, so I really wanted to try it out. And of course, I'm like really getting into skincare right now. Um, I'll just open it up and show you guys. Fine lines and wrinkles really like to appear when you have children. So, oh, this is a nice bottle. Look at that. That's pretty. Um, so we have that. And then uh, we also have this, the hydrating gel with hyaluronic acid. Um, so I got that. I, she used this on my facial and she just recommended it. And then this was the mask that she used, the ultra purifying clay mask. So really excited to try those out. Honestly, the other skincare stuff I use like is all the same that or brands. So Skin Medica, we have the Zo Skin that I use, um, Retinol Skin, Tatcha. I use the Overnight Repair. Uh, we have the Tatcha Deep Cleanse, which this is my favorite cleanser of all time. I buy the big one. Uh, the other things I've been going in with, I love this Avocado Recovery Serum. This is really nice by Glow Recipe. Um, really nice and lightweight. You can see I've definitely used a good chunk of it. Um, I haven't tried the guava yet. Hi, Boo. Hi, Mia. Are you going to help mommy clean her vanity? Thank you. It's a mess. But we did downstairs, didn't we? Your hair is getting so long. What are you doing? This is yours. I know, that's eyelash glue, honey. You don't want to put that on your hands. <laughs> Uh, and yeah, I or clearly I still have like all the little Christmas trees up too that I have to take down my uh, nutcracker. Let me know though. Did you guys take down all your Christmas stuff? I definitely am happy what that. What is it, Mama? That is mascara, honey boo boo. Where'd your sister go? My sister and Dad, Mama. What oh. is this, Mama? That's a blush. That bus? Mm-hmm. Why do you have to hold it? Okay. Since I have me here, I thought I would quickly show you guys the other stuff that obviously I use year-round. My palette. I've loved this mm -hmm. so much. So much. It's such a great everyday palette with the golds and neutrals and champagne tones. And yes, I'm still missing a nail. Um, two, actually. Both my middle fingers. So that's great. Um, hey, don't spray that, okay, honey? We don't want to use too much. Can you put it back for mommy, please? Thank hey, you. Um, other things that I've been using, pink mini brushes, my favorite for blush, bronzer. Um, yeah, don't use too much of that, honey. You don't want to spray it. I really like Christine Dominique's blushes. These ones right here, the cream blushes. There's one I was using nonstop. Ooh, this is the peach tone. Um, but my skin has just been super dry lately. That's why I've been going in with a lot of cream products. The other thing before I forget, the Kerastase Hair Oil, the Elixir. I do bottles of that good stuff. That's so nice and hydrating for my, uh, not my skin, my hair. So I really love using that. It's also a key product that I love um, to use. Oh yeah, that is a ring. Or no, that's an earring, honey. Earring. Can you find the other one? <laughs> the other thing I really like is this, uh, thank you, headband. Um, this really cute little Chanel that I got. I found two earrings. You found the other earring? Thank you, Mia. Uh, so this one right here, this little Chanel bag, you guys have seen this. It has like the silver and the gold on it. It's just great for storing like cards basically, but that's all I need if I have my um, coat. Then I put my phone in my pocket and then I just bring this really small little bag if I'm getting groceries or something. So that's been really great. Okay, the other things that I don't want to forget to show you, um, fuzziness. So this is from Dynamite. I am obsessed with the fuzzy collection. I have the pants in these, the shorts, and then also another thing, kind of random, but just hoodies. I love these hoodies from Dynamite. I wear them all the time. Uh, with sweatpants if I'm just being really casual uh, but they're great you can wear these year-round in the summertime with shorts like at night um, and I just love dynamite's clothes right now I wonder if I have um, 
I have the top as well. So I just wanted to show you guys this. See, just like that. So, I mean, it comes as a, as a full suit. You can wear those together. And I have this sweater to go over top. In the guest room now, which we do like to watch TV in here. Um, and it just gets them in a different Hello, environment because if you've had sick little ones and they are bored at home for two weeks, you know, it's, you gotta find things to do. <laughs> so now I've realized I do like watching TV in here, which is kind of nice. Um, and they like jumping on this bed, which I've also found out. Uh, and yeah, anyways, I really like the throw we have on this too. It's so nice and cozy. I got it from HomeSense. Um, but I think I'm going to wrap up here. I know it's, pro I'm not sure how long this vlog is going to be. Um, but I do have to get ready and I hope you guys have an amazing new year. Okay. So that was not working. I'm going to dry it here. This is their playroom area, their second one. Um, but I hope we have a better near or better year next year and, um, I'm just looking forward to obviously more family time um, and I think more self-love just you know having that free time for myself and uh, scheduling in you know appointments such as uh, massages and just like little getaways when we can because that stuff really matters and uh, yeah I just wish you guys the best. Thank you guys for being a part of the fam for so long. And if you've been here since the beginning, I really, really appreciate it and appreciate you. Um, clearly, I've gone through so much change since I started my channel. It's pretty crazy. I used to be so self-conscious about even wearing no makeup in my videos. And now I could get like, I could care less, you know, and I'm just so happy. I've finally gotten to that point where like, I don't care if I have dry lips. I don't care if like my alopecia is showing. I love that about myself now, just being open and real and authentic and raw, right? Like, it's just, what's the point of having a channel or having a platform if you can't be yourself and all of you? I think that's so important. So, a, you know, a tip that I can give to you if you're starting out is just be real. Um, it will only benefit you in the end. And we got to stop caring about all the little things in life because we don't have time for that. And I've realized that after having the girls, it's just like, you really don't have time for small little petty things. Um, that, you know, when we're teens or when we're younger, we t tend to focus on so much and there's just so much more importance in the world, health and happiness and, um, joy and, I'm just grateful that I have friends and family that literally support me so much and I have so much love in my life. So I really, really am fortunate and um, I'm so grateful for you as well and just having that connection with you and talking to you in my comment section all the time. Like it means the world to me. So I just wanted to say that. Um, I appreciate you. I'm going to be here a lot more. I want to get two, two videos up a week. That is my goal um, moving forward to 2022. And I will have a lot more time um, since we do have help now with a nanny. It has been life changing. Um, so yeah, stay with me. And also if you can just I really, really want to also grow this channel. I think, I think I have potential on just like expanding the channel. Um, but I mean, that's never really been a goal of mine. I think it's just more so maintaining, um, you know, the followers that I've already had and the loyal subscribers that I've had. Um, but I think if I can help any younger ones, especially that suffer from alopecia or struggling with just like, um, Sorry, camera died again, um, but feeling self-conscious about themselves or, uh, you know, that they can't be real or raw on, on a platform here, or maybe just, you know, there's just so much, so much, so many things that we struggle with when we're younger. So I think as far as expansion, I'd like to, to talk more about alopecia and just things like that, real things that occur, um, in a lot of people's lives, but, you know, just like myself have closed off for like 20 so years and just have tried to hide it when I don't think we need to do that. Um, so I think more so expanding in that sense, not like a following base. I just, I love the followers I already have and I appreciate you. So, um, hi, sweetheart, you need some help. Okay. It's time for me to go. Um, but I hope you guys have an awesome new year. Happy new year. Can you say happy new year? Happy new year.